Today marks the beginning of a new era in South Africa, as President Mandela takes office in Pretoria, facing issues that range from economic stagnation and unemployment to rising crime, while at the same time balancing black aspirations with white fears. Yeah, I never thought I'd see the day. I feel sorry for you, son. You've got your whole life ahead of you. What's it going to be like now? Ah, don't be so gloomy. Yeah. Now, I added vitamins. There's a horrible flu bug going around. You tell Marine when you get home, eh? Thanks, Mark. Yeah, I'm telling you, Francois. Look at Angola, look at Mozambique, and look at Zimbabwe. We're next. I'm going to take our jobs and I'm going to drive us into the sea. Just you wait. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Ah, Brenda, you've had your hair done. I like it. Thank you, Vidiva. Yeah, we need to talk about your cabinet appointments and ministers. Give me one moment, please. Yes, Vidiva. After you, come with the president. Thank you, sir. Office of the president, good morning. Brenda, please assemble all the staff for me. All those who haven't already left. Uh, right now? All of them? Yes, please. Yes, Mutiba. Ladies and gentlemen, if you would like to follow me, please. The president would like to speak with you. Here he comes. Yeah. He wants the satisfaction of firing us himself. I'd like you to stay out here. But what even I is cannot good. talk to them hiding behind men with guns. Good morning, Alma. Good morning. How are you this morning? Fine. It's good to see you. Thank you for coming on such short notice. Some of you may know who I am. I could not help noticing the empty offices as I came to work this morning and all of the packing boxes. Now, of course, if you want to leave, that is your right. And if you feel in your heart that you cannot work with your new government, then it is better that you do leave right away. But if you are packing up because you fear that uh, your language or the color of your skin or who you worked for before disqualifies you from working here. I am here to tell you, have no such fear. What is Rabay is Rabay. The past is the past. We look to the future now. We need your help. We want your help. If you would like to stay, you would be doing your country a great service. All I ask, is that you do your work to the best of your abilities and with good heart. I promise to do the same. If we can manage that, our country will be a shining light in the world. 